1500. On your marks. So 2.5 to 2.6 are the seed times. I wouldn't be surprised if they go through around that 60, 61 mark through the 400. As the pace is well and truly on as they go through. Martino leading them through this cut through. On the inside, Miller in next position. The Osvarian's runner there and starting to move nicely is William Stocky. Not much in this. Lucky Herb not so as we see them really starting to move out front, and that is Martino. He's a 205.30 runner. You can see Armstrong born with the white cap to starting to make his way around the outside of Miller. So Martino leads it. Miller, Ethan Armstrong born to the outside. We have Stocky moving nicely. Then the Essendon runner there, and that is Parker. So Matthew's starting to make a bit of a move, and Snyder's at the rear of the field, but Martino leading it beautifully out front. So as we've seen a bit tonight, the early leaders tend to just get chased down this home straight on the second lap, and it is Armstrong Bourne who's doing the chasing, but they're really well strung out. The Essendon runner Parker now making a beautiful move down the back straight and chasing down into third position and going for second. So 200 out. Martino's done a lot of the work out front, but it is Parker chasing him. Can't see too many other moves coming from this field. I think it's going to be the two out front, and Parker probably looking the goods as he comes round the top bend into the home straight. So the local boy from Essendon, Darcy Parker, he's a 205.20 runner. So got the home crowd really cheering here, and that is an impressive run. So Darcy Parker looking so strong. My God, we might get him just under the two. It's going to be close. I think he'll just miss it. But great running there, Darcy Parker, right on the two-minute mark. Good running from Martino as well. Stocky through next, then big finish there from Matthews. Miller, Snyders, and Armstrong born. The G, Darcy Parker, nearly got the sub two. Great running there in the men's I-800.